Did you know that there are alternative sources of protein besides our everyday chicken and duck rice? From plant-based meats to cricket flour, the way we think about food is changing, and fast. As Singapore works towards bolstering its food security, alternative proteins could play a surprisingly bigger role. So what exactly are they, and why should you care? Alternative proteins are proteins that don't come from conventional animal sources. Instead, they're made from plants like soy or wheat, cultivated meat grown from animal cells, algae or fungi-based proteins, and even insects like crickets and silkworms. These innovative options don't just offer more protein sources, they can be delicious and even good for the planet. Singapore imports more than 90% of its food, which means we're vulnerable to global supply disruptions. That's where alternative proteins come in. They play a role in bolstering our food security while also reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Studies have shown that emissions from food production make up more than a third of global greenhouse gases, with beef production causing the most environmental harm. Did you know that substituting just half of the red meat we eat with plant-based alternatives could cut food-related emissions by over 25%? Here in Singapore, alternative proteins like plant-based and cultivated meats, as well as edible insects, are already on the shelves, offering sustainable protein options. While some of these alternative proteins have long been in our diet, Others may not have been consumed by humans and are thus required to undergo additional safety assessments before they can be sold in Singapore. Companies work with the Singapore Food Agency to ensure that alternative proteins are safe before these are made available to consumers. And as more options for alternative protein become available, clear labeling, terms like mock, cultured or made from insects, make it easier for consumers to make informed choices. Trying alternative proteins doesn't mean giving up your favorite chicken rice or beef rendang. It's about making small, meaningful changes. While food preferences can be shaped by cultural and societal norms, we can always shift our mindset to be more open to new and exciting options. So, why not give alternative proteins a try? Want to explore more? Check out these titles at our libraries. Discover these and more to dive deeper into this topic.